Hey guys, I'm finally back, and I was waiting until they actually released the jailbreak for all the devices on iOS 4.0, and they finally did yesterday, Comex did, and so we should thank him, although he did keep us waiting for a while, but um, here it is, so extremely, extremely simple jailbreak, you won't have any unable to recognize specified EPSW um, problems, you won't have any waiting for reboot, like stuck on that problems, you won't have any problems with your power button because you have to put into DFU mode by holding that and the home button, extremely easy, it's like two steps, so let's get ready for it, so make sure your iPod is plugged in and it is updated to the 4.0 I mean, yeah, to iOS 4.0. You can do this through iTunes, where it says update available right here. So, after you do that, make sure your iTunes is updated to 9.2.1. And if it's not, it should automatically prompt you when you start it up if you want to update it. So, go ahead and do that and finish it. And you want to back up everything on your iPod before you um, update, but it'll probably ask you. So this iPod, this is my test iPod if you guys are wondering, all of you guys have put comments that it's beat up and looks crap, looks like crap, that's because it is not, it's just like my test iPod, it's not my real one, but I use it for jailbreaks. So um, let's get started here. Okay, so after that, go ahead to your iPod and make sure you do have a secure Wi-Fi connection. Open up your Safari browser, tap the URL bar, and X out whatever's there. I have Google here. And you're going to want to type in HTTP, HTTP, and you're going to want the little um, colon and two forward slashes, and type in jailbreakme.com that's j a i l b r e a k dot me m e dot com go ahead and go to that url so when it's done loading you should get this little screen it says jailbreak me by comex thank you for that and it says a little description about jailbreaking and just slide to jailbreak to start the jailbreaking process now it's going to download the software. It might take a little while, but hey, there's no other problems. So when it's finished downloading and it's actually doing the jailbreaking process, it's going to tell you to sit tight, and you will sit tight for a few minutes. Okay, after you are done sitting tight, it should say City has been added to the home screen. Have fun. So just go ahead and press OK. Tap the home button to exit out of Safari. When you slide your screen, you should have Cydia, which indicates that your iPod or iPhone is now jailbroken. And, yep, simple as that. It works on all devices. For iPad, it's not iOS 4.0, it's um, iOS 3.2.1. But, you know, hey, it still works. It works on iPhone 4s and iPhone 3GSs with the new boot ROM for 4.1. 0.1 I believe and it works on every other device for iOS 4.0 easy as that and yep that's just another jailbroken video from Tech Charge and I hope you guys have a good day